So well, I hope people get, get to the spirit. There is a prank spirit, but there is also, it's a prank. It's like uh, many papers, uh, like a meme, memes that aspire to be like papers. And an important point I touched that when we choose the memes, the artist that created the meme, we kind of accept that anybody that becomes like public domain. I mean, they will still be the artist of that NFT. They will take secondary sales, whatever, you know, we, we, we will uh, design how to do it. Okay. And, uh, but everybody will be used to pick up uh, our memes and, and reuse them. And uh, I would need to make sure that we create funny stories, a funny situation, stuff that hit the imagination. We don't know what will succeed what people will use. We just created it, but, um, my direction is to make uh, sure they are distinctive uh, enough to kind of connect them to the mystery of this message that is meant to keep inspiring people for centuries, I hope to come, no matter the difficult condition in which uh, we will find ourselves and the mat manipulation we receive. Maybe they are not needed, maybe we will be enlightened and create free society by ourselves. But in uh, in times of catacombs, that is stuff that can raise from the catacombs, no? And uh, and it's better to plant the seed now. Yeah. And um, so this is just not just one project; it's many projects. I will try to get people to invest in it to really collect the art of the artist. So we're stimulating artists to participate and um, at various levels just by doing one work or being part of the community because uh, the long-term goals is to actually create a culture and um, contaminate popular culture and um, and, um, and empower uh, uh, cultural initiatives and um, other movements that respond to our values that are the values of progress, of um, you know, uh, yep. culture, of tolerance, uh, of uh, a wisdom that is present uh, in all most religions, really, and that uh, so this two K and come basically that everybody so far I, I agree to, apart to one guy that, uh, <laughs> but I think it, it, it was an enemy, a temporary enemy in disguise. There was like some sort of. Uh, a crazy monk that was very traditionalist uh, that wanted to kind of burn me and a stake and I was like uh, you know it's 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 all good it's all fine you know you just <laughs> don't need to believe it you know it's I'm not presenting it as something sacred and they should not be sacred because it's uh, yeah. emb embedded in the commandment that the words needs not to be taken to, to seriously and I think this century and this millennium we need more of this culture that uh, i don't see sprouting that much from below so um, i have something you know if you want to use it take it because also this will be like uh, you can use them uh, as you want maybe you know don't modify the the, the copy otherwise it is a uh, heresy and if you commit uh, heresy the punishment is that we cannot be buddies you know but uh, you know, other than that, uh, you know, just use, you know. <laughs> yeah, but I think.